You know, living tomorrow is what we're all going to be doing, and this series is designed to give you a glimpse of what to expect. Now, it's not pie in the sky, distant future stuff either. It's all in development right now, and you can expect to see it in your world very soon. Medicine in particular will see some stunning advances. There will be new ways to look inside the human body for disease, and new ways to keep disease from starting in the first place by manipulating the basic genetic code for life. The really big news is the cracking of the human genome, the genetic code that makes up every molecule of who we are. It's made in series of base pairs that are billions of segments in length. That diversity can work against us though, making our responses to different medicines and medical treatments more unpredictable. However, with the solving of the genetic code, scientists talk of screening each of us genetically to see our susceptibility to certain diseases. A big one is cancer, which can be spotted by certain genetic markers in the person's DNA. Treatment of that disease can begin far before any symptoms begin to appear. Scientists are also using this knowledge to create proteins genetically engineered to attack certain diseases. They will also be able to better predict how certain drugs will interact with you and with other drugs in your body, reducing or eliminating side effects that are sometimes almost as bad as the disease itself. A key to curing a disease is spotting it in its earliest stages before it's been able to do much damage. Aside from providing us with ways to spot genetic markers of disease, research today has given us better, more detailed ways to look inside of a human's body. X-rays were used as part of the first diagnostic imaging systems, but what you get with them isn't always clear. For one thing, they're flat. Disease exists in three dimensions. Tomorrow's imaging systems will scan the body in all three dimensions, allowing doctors to look at any organ or any tumor from any angle. And they'll also be able to look inside of it with unprecedented clarity. Molecular imaging systems like the PET-CT can scan the body down to the cellular level spotting changes in cells that could be precursors to cancer. A main goal of this technology is to reduce or eliminate the need for surgery altogether. This makes sense for practical reasons as well as medical ones. As the population of the industrialized world ages, the cost of their medical care rises. Staying healthy will turn out to be a lot cheaper than getting sick. And finally, technology tomorrow could eliminate the need for you to see the doctor altogether in many circumstances. The reason? For some things, your house could be your doctor. Here at Living Tomorrow's Senior Flat, various systems have been developed to gather vital medical information and transmit it to your doctor. This toothbrush, for example, is for more than just cleaning your teeth. Hold it in your hand, and it's also taking your pulse and transmitting that information to your doctor. And if you want to talk to your doctor about anything your household system finds, you can teleconference from home. Say goodbye to endless waits in doctor's waiting rooms. So there you have it, the medicine of tomorrow will keep you healthier, longer. Which is great because there's a lot of things you're going to want to stick around to see. I'm Vince Jolivet, and I'll see you tomorrow.